Hello, this time we will talk about how to install Home Assistant to your Windows 11 computer. So I will uh, put the link of the old downloads uh, into my video description. So you can check that over there. So when you go to the Home Assistant uh, official website, go to Start. Then go to Installation. From the right side, you can see the Windows. Click the Windows again. And we choose the Virtual Box. It's a Oracle Virtual Box. It is a, a free uh, virtual machine software. So you can download the Windows uh, installer. I also will put the download link to my video description. So after you download it, let's open it. It will download to your download folder. It is zip file, so we need to unzip it. Okay, so after we unzip it, we go to the documents, create a new folder over there. Let's give it a name, Home Assistant. Oh, I already have that name already over there. Okay, so I already, uh, already create a folder named Home Assistant and I copy the download file over there. So next step, we need to open the Oracle Virtual Box. So when you open it, we create, click New, and then we switch to Export mode. Give it a name. Folder. We choose the folder we just make under the document Home Assistant. Select this folder. We don't need to select an ISO image. The type, we need to select Linux. And the version, we need to select, uh, it is actually on top of that. So we select Linux 64 bits. We do need to uh, configure and install, but we do need to uh, add the hardware. So for memory, we need using 2 gigabytes memory. And to processor, it's better to use a uh, two CPU, okay? And we also need enable EFI. So we check enable. Now we configure the hard disk. We need to use existing virtual hard disk file, which is uh, click add. Then we go to the documents, home assistance and the select the one we just download and copy to that folder. Open, choose. Okay. So after that, we click finish. But at this point, don't need, uh, do, do not start it. We need to do two more settings. The first setting is audio. Audio controller, we select Intel HD audio and the light work. So adapter one, enable network adapter, the attach to, we need attach to bridge adapter. Okay. So click OK. After that, we can start the virtual machine.
Okay, now we, you can see the virtual machine start. And you can see the IP4, IPv4 address is 192.6168.1.166. So if you, you can also use the Home Assistant URL to access the virtual machine, which means uh, Home Assistant. So now it's open an uh, export, export browser, and uh, we type home, home assistant dot local, comma, eight one two three. So it may take about uh, twenty minutes to finish the configuration. But uh, if you cannot use in the home assistant dot local to uh, comma eight one two three to access that, you can also use in the IP address showing on the screen to access it. So which means you just type in the IP address. So one ninety two one six eight dot one dot one six six eight one two three okay let's double check one point one six six one point one six six so you can also use in the IP address to access it let's wait Okay, so when it finished configuration, you need to create a, a user account. So we're using cap username, password, create account, name of the installer, and it asks the address. Then we go to next. So country, time zoom, blah, blah. We go to next and keep all of them by default and we can finish it so now we success uh, install the home assistant so the next step i will show you how to install uh, how to config uh, the ip camera uh, our the smart lock to the system okay hope you enjoy this video Bye-bye.